All right, hello everyone, and welcome back to some more Virtue's Last Reward. And so, where we just jumped into is the timeline where we had to ally in order to get the Excelivir off of Dio. Sigma. Results from round two of the Ambidex game will now be displayed. Please check your bracelet to see your updated bracelet points. What? Sigma's BP is... Negative! Sigma! Sigma! Hang on! Hey! Sigma! Get up! Sigma! Oh no! Oh no, oh no, oh no! yours? Aren't we supposed to share everything we find here? What are you talking about? And Dio stole it! W what you, you mean he has it? Right now? Yeah. So? Right, of course. <laughs> S 
Sigma! Are you okay? Jesus, this is Sigma! Scary. Sigma! First, is this over real? What shot you to sleep? Nine minutes later, the tumocurin is injected, numbing your respiratory muscles. I guess you could say it'll really take your breath away. You gotta find some way to break his arm off, because it's robotics. What? S Sigma! What are you saying? <laughs> Looks like you finally gave up. Whatever. I was just about to flip the switch anyway. Hey, don't rush me. Okay, you've got 9 BP now, right? Y yes Well, what do you say? Wanna come with? I... I... I will remain here. Why? I cannot abandon Sigma. But... I understand. Great! Glad we got that settled. Shall we go? No! Stop! It's been fun! Peace! I promise to call for help and return as soon as I can. Please, do not give up hope. Huh?
Oh shit. Hey! What are you doing, you bastard? The door's gonna close! Let go! Let go, goddammit! Let go! this shit? Why are you doing this? I kept my promise, didn't I? What? Shit! Stop screwing around, asshole! I have to get out of here. I'm not going to let my sacred mission get fucked up by some self-righteous idiot. The number nine door has closed. This ends the nonary game. Thank you for your participation. As the game is over, all doors other than the number nine door have been unlocked. Escape is not possible. Please enjoy your stay. Oh shit, it worked. Sigma! Sigma! Finally awake, huh? <laughs> I guess they carried you out here after you passed out. Well, I wasn't there to see it. I was out just like you. But I was in the AB room. That bastard Kay. He punched me in the stomach. I can't believe him. He didn't want me voting, so... Yes. On the other side of the number nine door, with Dio. You told him to go, remember? Is your arm okay? I heard what happened. Cybernetic arms, huh? Can't say I'm surprised. I was starting to get a feeling something was up with you. from that jerk deal, right? Luna gave it to me and now I'm better. Thanks. Your 
You're the best, Mr. Sigma. You saved my life. It was completely the opposite of what we guessed. We're not infected. The rest of the world is. That means this place isn't a quarantine facility. It's more like a shelter. Well, we don't know anything for sure yet. I thought the same thing you did, but then Sigma pointed out a couple of discrepancies. <laughs> Someone anticipated the pandemic. I don't know who. Probably Zero. Anyway, they grabbed us before the pandemic really started. Then they put us in the shelter. But then, after a while he got bored, so he decided to have us play this game to kill time. <laughs> Well, we don't actually know if there is poison in this bracelet. You're the only one who's gotten injected so far. And when you did, it was only Soberil. No, that's not what I mean. That can't be it. I'm sure there's Tubocurarine in the bracelets. The Atom's analysis confirmed it. But what if the Atom is lying? If you're going to do that, then we don't have anything to base any speculations on. You could say that the newspaper article was fake, or that the Latin journal wasn't real. Or the journal was real, but my translation was a lie. No, my translation was accurate. I'm just making the point that once you start talking about this stuff being fabricated, it doesn't stop. I don't think Zero is doing this just to take the piss out of a lime. What? Uh... I was just trying to stress that I don't think Zero would do this to pass the time. However, I do think Clover has half a point. That someone did anticipate this pandemic. That part seems reasonable. Well, if the virus was spread on purpose, then I could see how that might make sense. Yeah. It's not like Noah put all the animals on his ark after the flood happened. He went around before the rain started falling to gather them all up, right? Are you saying that we were rescued because we're all that's left of humanity? We were brought here because someone knew there would be a pandemic that would turn us into an endangered species? Does that mean we're supposed to... repopulate the planet? Game's over. There's no point to any of this now. No, that's not true. The game might be over, but we've still got a lot of unanswered questions. In fact, we've got even more questions. So, are those answers going to open the number nine door again? 
it's all over. Why we're stuck here doesn't mean shit. The eight of us aren't leaving, ever. That's all that matters. You... you're including the old woman? Yeah. Hey, you know what? What if the old lady is Zero Senior? But that would mean the person in charge of all this was murdered by somebody. That doesn't make sense. Maybe she wasn't murdered. Huh? Are you saying she was infected with Radical Six and killed herself? Maybe she was killed somewhere else. And then someone carried her in there. Well, maybe we should go take a look at her one more time. Maybe we missed something. Confirms what I already knew about Tammy OG. That's fucking Akane. Looks like an ID card for this place. Since it's got her picture on it, I'd say it's a safe bet the card is hers. Nope. You? Yep, pass equals jumpy to all. That's fucking a Connie. Holy shit. Well, actually it says pass equals jumpy doll. So I'm guessing jumpy doll is a password of some sort. Beats me. Tammy Oji knows what that means. <laughs> Yeah. Alice! What's wrong? Alice! Oh no! What are you planning to do with that? <gasps> Damn it! Goodbye. Alright, well, that, that entirely confirms two things. One, the old woman was a Kanye. Two, the old woman was talking about Junpei when she was telling Kay about the person that she deeply cared about. Actually, I guess there's the third thing. The third thing is, Tammy Oji absolutely has to be fucking Junpei. He has a picture of Akane from when she was younger.
and the way he reacted when he saw her dead means that he knew who she was. But anyways, that's going to do it for this episode. We only have two more goddamn endings to go through. Thank you so much for tuning in. And until next time, peace.